the British Isles has played a central role in the discovery of dinosaur fossils. It was within Britain that the first dinosaur fossils were discovered and recognised as being a distinct group of reptiles. It was early British naturalists such as William Buckland, Guinea Mantle and Richard Owen that discovered and named many of the early dinosaurs and gave a real boost to this branch of paleontology. So in this video what I want to do is take a quick look at 10 significant British dinosaur finds. 10. Metriacanthosaurus First described in 1923 by Friedrich von Huhn, Metriacanthosaurus is a 8 metre long theropod from the Jurassic rocks around Weymouth in Dorset. It was originally described as a species of Megalosaurus. However, due to much more recent studies, Metriacanthosaurus has been reclassified as a type of Synraptorid. Now, the Synraptorids were a group of dinosaurs closely related to Allosaurus, and Metriacanthosaurus is significant in the fact that it is currently the only known Synraptorid found outside of Asia. 9. Eustreptospondylus When Eustreptospondylus was discovered in Oxfordshire in 1870, it was the most complete theropod that had been found to that date, and the relative completeness of this specimen provided vital evidence that theropods were bipedal animals and very different to the original images of these quadrupedal, almost meat-eater looking rhinoceroses that has been envisioned up to that point. At about 5 metres long, Eustreptospondylus is still the most complete mid-Jurassic theropod found in Europe. 8. Scolidosaurus From the early Jurassic cliffs between Charmouth and Lyme Regis, Scolidosaurus is one of the earliest and most basal thyrophoran dinosaurs known. This 4 metre long armoured herbivore once roamed the Jurassic coast. Known from several nearly complete specimens, Scolidosaurus is one of the most well understood dinosaurs from the British Isles and is the only one currently found in, on the island of Ireland. 7. Hyliosaurus This early Cretaceous armoured dinosaur was discovered in Cuckfield in 1833 making it the third dinosaur found. It was one of the original three used by Richard Owen in 1842 to define the clay Dinosauria. It was the first armoured dinosaur discovered and even had a life-size replica made of it for the Crystal Palace exhibition of 1854, making it part of the first set of dinosaur sculptures anywhere in the world. 6. Tychodontosaurus At 208 million years old, Tychodontosaurus is the oldest confirmed dinosaur from the British Isles. It is a basal sauropodomorph and represents a time when the sauropodomorphs had recently diverged from the theropods. Discovered in 1836, this 2.5 metre long herbivore was the fourth dinosaur discovered, though it was not recognised as being such until 1870. 5. Proceratosaurus Known only from a single skull and mandible, found in Minchinhampton Common in 1910, this three metre long crested carnivore is currently the oldest known member of the clade Tyrannosauridae. From the Middle Jurassic period, Proceratosaurus is from a time when Tyrannosaurs had recently diverged from the other theropods and gives us clues as to what the ancestors of this most famous group of extinct reptiles looked like. 4. Cetiosaurus, named the whale lizard in 1841 by Richard Owen. Due to its size, Cetiosaurus was originally mistaken for a large marine reptile. At close to 20 metres long, Cetiosaurus is one of the largest dinosaurs found in Europe. It was the first sauropod discovered, and is still the most complete and well understood sauropod from the British Isles. 3. Baryonyx Discovered in the clay pit in Oakley, Surrey, in 1983, Baryonyx was originally a bit of a mystery. It had a crocodilian-like snout, and fish remains in its stomach, providing our first evidence of Pisivoran activity within dinosaurs. It became famous for the large claw on its index finger, but as nothing like Baryonyx had been found up to that point, its connection with the other theropods was unknown. At roughly 70% complete, Baryonyx turns out to be one of the most complete theropods found within Europe, but also one of the most complete members of a group of theropods called the Spinosaurids and provides evidence that this group of reptiles lived a semi-aquatic lifestyle. 2. Iguanodon First described in 1823, Iguanodon was the second dinosaur known to science. Originally known only from teeth, numerous Iguanodon have been found over the years, 
including well over 30 individuals that were found in a coal mine in Belgium in 1878. Iguanodon was one of the three animals used by Richard Owen to define the clade Dinosauria. At around 10 metres long, Iguanodon is an iconic reptile and was one of the first to feature in worldwide pop culture, including the two life-size sculptures at the Crystal Palace exhibition of 1854. It also appeared in Arthur Conan's Doyle book The Lost World and the works of German artist Heinrich Harder. And on a special note, is my personal favourite dinosaur. 1. Megalosaurus Let's be honest here, there really wasn't any doubt that I'd pick this one as number one. Described in 1824, Megalosaurus was the animal that started it all. The first large land reptile known to science, and at about 9 metres long, Megalosaurus was a good sized theropod. Originally found in Oxfordshire, remains of this animal have come from other parts of the UK. Used by Richard Owen to establish Dinosauria as a taxonomic group in 1842, and recreated for the Great Exhibition, Megalosaurus forever changed our perspective of the prehistoric world.